Hello, and welcome to another episode of Science by Mr. Healy. In today's episode, we'll be looking at the use of a voltmeter with a Sigmatron board. Now, in a previous episode, we've looked at how to use an ammeter with a Sigmatron board, but in this episode, we'll look at both of them and also the voltmeter by itself, working with a Sigmatron board. Now, of course, we'll need an ammeter and a voltmeter. Now, they're both uh, uh, digital multimeters, but for sake of differentiation, we're going to highlight the ammeter with blue. And we also have our connectors, the jumper and the resistor, and our design plan to help us prepare for uh, working with the Sigmatron board. So let's set out in creating the following circuit, a simple series circuit with an ammeter, a voltmeter connected in parallel to a resistor, and a power source with a positive and negative terminal. So our first option would be to place the jumper and the resistor like so. Now, again, if you want to connect a voltmeter, you have to connect it in parallel according to Kirchhoff's laws. And we get a reading of 20 volts. Second option would be to push the resistor a bit further down and again, connect the voltmeter and you get again the same reading, 20 volts, and it is connected in parallel with red facing the, uh, with red being the negative terminal facing the negative terminal of the power source and black being the, po the positive terminal facing the positive terminal of the power source. Uh, let's look at another option here. Now we've got two jumpers and a resistor. And again, I have a closed circuit and I'm going to connect my voltmeter and voila, again, I have a, 20, a measure of 20 volts. Fourth option would be to use the same circuit we had before, but now I'm going to add another resistor and I'm going to measure the voltages on both of these resistors. Now, according to Kirchhoff's laws, the voltage in series circuit is not the same. Uh, it's the sum of these voltages that would give the VT, or the total voltage. So here we have 20 volts, here we've got 35 volts. So as you can see, the voltages are not the same. Now working with the Sigmatron board, let's make this circuit. So we've got ourselves a closed circuit with a jumper and two resistors. Now we're going to get rid of this jumper and we're going to add a ammeter just uh, so that we show, we can show you that we can work at both at the same time. And we have a voltmeter here attached in parallel. Notice the difference. One of them is directly in the circuit. The other one is in parallel to a resistor. And a second voltmeter right here. And again, two different readings. That's it.